Hey everyone, it's Eric and today I have a huge Bath and Body Works body care haul and three wick candle haul for you. Um, a lot of this is from last weekend's 550 body care sale. Is that good? <laughs> Marvelous. Everything's on sale. You can pick up some terrific bargains. I also picked up some candles during it. So let's just get into it. There is a lot to talk about. So during that 550 body care sale, that's a great time to pick up Christmas gifts for people. I mean, you know, you can get some really good deals. Uh -huh. There's very few sales that are going to beat the 550 other than like a SAS sale, maybe body care day. But other than that, you know, they don't usually go too much lower than 550. Like right now, today, they're doing the fine fragrance mist for 595. So the 550 was a better deal to get some of those uh, fragrance mists. So the first two things I picked up were uh, Christmas gifts. Oh, here, it's beauty time! <laughs> and they are the iced sugar plum in the body cream and the um, fine fragrance mist. So it's sparkling sugar plum, snowdrop petals, and whipped marshmallow. I did smell this in the store. It didn't smell bad. Um, it, it did have a nice kind of a marshmallow, caramely kind of fragrance to it. So that's not a bad deal. Uh, five fifty for each of these when they're originally sixteen fifty each. So pretty good deal, I think. Next, I picked up another. This is also uh, Christmas gift items. Uh, I picked up the champagne toast in the spray and in this body cream. It's, uh, bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, and juicy tangerine. And these both run at $17.50, so getting them for $5.50 each is a great deal. Uh, I also picked up, to go with those two items, I picked up this Magic in the Air. I have no idea what this one smells like, but I just thought it kind of would look nice in the um, bag with uh, the champagne toast. But this is almond flour, sparkling persimmon, white iris, whipped vanilla bourbon, and fluffy sandalwood. And then I also picked up strawberry snowflakes. This is juicy strawberry whipped cream and iced bergamot. And I think that one's new this year. I know in the candle it smells um, pretty light. So I got those. And then also picked up this um, rainbow swirl candy bath fizzy and a strawberry pound cake bath fizzy to go into the bags as well with the body care items. So that I believe is all the Christmas gift items I picked up for people. So everything else I think most of this is for me. <laughs> so okay. In this case I, I'm gonna put me first. So the first thing I picked up was for myself was this uh, aromatherapy the juniper and sage. I really like um, juniper and I like sage. So I did smell this, and it smells really good, you guys, so I'm really looking forward to using this. I also picked it up in the um, the bath soak salts. I've never purchased their bath salts before, but mm, it smells so good and fresh. I love it. Just real clean smelling, so I don't know. I always think to myself, like, one of these days I'll do, like, a spa day for myself, but I never do. It's like, I'm always just running around doing crazy stuff, but it's a nice thought, so maybe one of these days I'll get around to it. So I picked those both up on that 550 sale. Again, you know, really good savings because, like, this bath salts are running at $18.50, so for $550, that's a pretty good deal. And then the body cream was $17.50. Bargain hunting's a challenge. It's fun. Uh, the next thing I picked up was another mineral and sea salt. I really like this, you guys, so I picked another one of those up, you know, before they retire it or whatever they're going to do with it. I also picked up um, the Smoked Old Fashioned in the body cream and in the 3-in-1 uh, body wash. And this is that Smoked Orange Bitters, Bourbon Vanilla, and Cedarwood. I'm really liking this one, you guys. It's so manly and fresh all day. There's something about an aqua velvet man. It's just really nice for the fall. I think it's just a nice fall fragrance. So I'm really enjoying that. So for $5.50, I picked those up. Next, I picked up um, another Twisted Peppermint. I love the Twisted Peppermint around the holidays, you guys. I know there's a lot of people out there that use this year-round, but around the holidays, I do like this fragrance in the house. 
I like to use this in the evening before I go to bed. It's cool peppermint, sugar snow, fresh balsam, and vanilla buttercream. So I did pick that up in the uh, body cream. I also picked it up a shower gel of it. And I also picked up one of the Twisted Peppermint Bar Soaps. I've never purchased their bar soaps, but I thought, you know, I, I try one. They're originally $8.50, so down to $5.50. It's not the best deal, but I never buy the bar soap, so I thought this would be a nice time to at least just try one of them. So I did get that, and then I also picked up Christmas Cookies. Cookies is part of the magic of Christmas. In the body cream. I, I've had this before. I really like this one. It's Creamy cookie dough, almond biscotti, and caramel woods. So I did pick up that. And then I also picked up a vanilla bean Noel in the body scrub. So that, that is it for the body care. I also, uh, they had some of the wallflowers on a sale as well. It smells like a cabbage patch in here. Here's a new air freshener. Um, i trying to remember what that was. I know... I know I did pick up a pumpkin bonfire on their fall sale. I think these were like $3.50, I believe. So I picked up a pumpkin bonfire in the wallflowers. And then also I picked up a twisted peppermint. Now this one I think they were $3.95. So there are better sales for these, but I just wanted to pick that up. They had that free shipping going on, so I thought, well, since I'm only getting one of those, just throw it in the bag. And then I also picked up the... Um, the two pack of this cranberry pear bellini. I don't remember this one for some reason. I, I have a feeling this is an older fragrance. I mean, this box is, I don't know if you can see, but it's all like damaged and ripped up. But um, the, the wildflower refills in there are intact and they didn't leak. So that's the only thing I really care about. So yeah, so uh, your set notes on this are fizzy pear, nectar, sparkling cranberries, and apricot. Sounds good. Sounds really nice to me, so I thought that would be something interesting to try. And it, they, that was like, they're like 50% off or something. I don't know, something like that. So that was like, okay. The next thing I picked up, you guys, was the, um, I'm so happy to get this. So excited, I think I'm gonna explode! Uh, was the Bath & Body Works um, advent calendar. So I wasn't sure how this would ship, and I wanted to show you this, how it got shipped in the box. It came with this cardboard sleeve around it so it wouldn't get damaged, and then it's packed in the plastic. And I wanted to show you guys that because I was kind of nervous about buying it with all this body care and stuff in the box because it all got shipped together in the same box. I thought, gosh, I don't want that advent calendar box to get damaged. But um, so I'm just going to open this up. So... So I was really happy with how they shipped it. So there, there it's the box. And these are originally run for $90.90, kind of an odd price point. But right now they are on sale for $55. I don't know about you, but I'm not made of money, honey. Um, the whole reason I really wanted this, you guys, was there is a um, Christmas ornament in it. And I really want the Christmas ornament. And it's funny because the Christmas ornament that they show in the picture was actually a, a three wick candle from last year that I actually saved the jar from and it's the tis the season. I believe it's this three wick candle from last year that they use as the ornament for this year. But um, I loved this jar style so much that I saved it, cleaned it all out so I could keep it and just put like a tea light or something in it and use it just as a decorative piece in the house somewhere. So I'm pretty sure that is the ornament that they used. Uh, and then also what you have in here is, it says you have an exclusive Merry Cookie single wick candle, an exclusive Merry Cookie gentle foaming hand soap, you have the ornament, and you have Vanilla Bean Noel travel size shower gel, Vanilla Bean Noel travel size fine fragrance mist, winter candy apple pocket back hand sanitizer, winter candy apple hand cream, a vanilla bean concentrated room spray, tis the season wallflowers fragrance refill, a white flare wallflowers fragrance plug, and a gold glitter pocket back holder. So I figure any of the stuff I don't really want in here, I'll just kind of gift off to people. 
So, but I was really happy with this. It's really cute how they did the packaging for it. And that would make a nice gift for somebody that's into Bath and Body Works, I think. They have that advent calendar to open something um, for 12 days. It's kind of a nice idea. Okay, so now let's get into the candles, you guys. It's a lot of stuff here. Well then, let's get the party started. They also had one of the days where some of the fall candles that were on sale, you could take an additional 20% off some of the select fall candles. So I did take advantage of that and I picked up it, an extra pumpkin carving. And of course, pumpkin carving is the freshly carved pumpkin, spiced pumpkin seeds, and smooth brown sugar. I've been burning this all Halloween weekend. This is just a really nice fragrance, you guys, that I really, really enjoy. So I picked up an extra pumpkin carving to have around. And then I also picked up the... Um, white balsam and vanilla. I'm not crazy about the packaging at all, but I do like the fragrance in this. And the scent notes are fresh white pine, chilled forest air, and warm vanilla musk. Yeah, it just smells like pine with vanilla to me. It's just a nice fragrance. I'm kind of surprised we haven't um, gotten a Christmas version of this, uh, Christmas packaging of this yet. Uh, but we might not. Um, I can't remember if we had one last year. I know we had it in the fall, so maybe we didn't get one at last Christmas either. But anyways, I figured for $10.36, because that's what this came to, and also the same with the pumpkin carving, I'm like, that's, that's like candle day prices, you guys, so. What a great deal. Picked that up as well. I thought that was a really good deal to get one of those. Uh, next up, I did pick up and this is, this is getting returned, you guys. So I purchased this before I actually got to try it the other week. But it's a Falala Latte. And this is a Falala No Way. Big flop, you mean. This, you guys, I don't know if I've ever said this about a Bath & Body Works candle. But save your money. Buy something else. This is a dud, in my opinion. It's just not worth the money i don't think so that's going back and get changed for something else and i think that's like the harshest i've ever been <laughs> with one of their candles you guys so that's going back the next thing i um also got was the balsam and firewood i really like the jar styles on these you guys and i know they're luminaries so i'm really excited to try this and i love the fragrance of this candle the scent notes are cedarwood cardamom and white birch it smells a little light this year, you guys. So I did pull out my balsam and firewood from last year. And, well, that smells kind of light too, actually. So maybe, maybe it's just light on cold. But I just, I remember last year with this, you guys, it had such a wonderful throw. I really enjoyed it. Just had a nice balsam kind of smoky fragrance to it. I really enjoyed it. So I'm really excited to pick this up. Uh, the other one I picked up was the cinnamon and clove buds. And I don't know about you guys. I have not been able to find that in a store yet. So I was so happy to purchase it online. And then, of course, the one I got, um, this is the only thing that did not arrive intact. It's just all, like, shattered. There's just glass everywhere in there, you guys. And, um, yeah, so this I've got to do an exchange on. And, um, but really pretty jar style. And, yeah, so the uh, scent notes on this are cinnamon leaf, clove bud, and ground nutmeg. And hopefully this is in the stores now so I can just go in and do an exchange. If not, I'll just call the, call the company up and they can set out a new one. They're really good about that. So that did get damaged. Not a big deal. That's easily fixed. We try, please. The last four candles I purchased were those glass, all glass jar candles. So the first one is the Winter Candy Apple. It comes in this really pretty candy apple red jar style. And they have this really uh, pretty, kind of like a snowflake jar, uh, glass lid. Your scent notes, of course, are the red apple, crisp pear, and candied oranges. Yeah, it's not, Winter Candy Apple's never been like my favorite, so I kind of wish they would have maybe done different fragrances for these, like maybe something a little new or unique 
to put in these all glass jars. But I really do like uh, this red, uh, candy apple red jar style. So picked that up. I also picked up the frozen lake in the blue. Um, it's lavender leaves, cool eucalyptus, and juniper berries. Yeah, it's okay. Again, it's this frozen lake is not one of my favorites. What? But like I said, I really like these all glass jars. So I decided to go ahead and just pick it up anyways. And then they did uh, bring out Fireside finally in a winter style jar in this. <gasps> Hurrah! Yeah! Because so far we just had it in a jar style for the fall. Uh, so I was glad to see it come out here for winter. I really do like the Fireside. It's smoked cedar, fresh clove bud, and warm embers. This one's just a really smoky um, candle. It's got a little bit of a cologne, kind of a cologne fragrance in there as well with that smokiness. But I've always liked this one on a cold night. So Fireside, picked up Fireside. And then the last one is the Cedar and Suede in the green. I really like this green uh, color they did for this one. It's Soft Cedar, Warm Incense, and Velvety Suede. Suede. It's, it smells nice, you guys. It's got like a nice incense smell to it and the cedar. This is the only one I really was kind of excited to get out of the four. I mean, this one and the um, Fireside are the two that I was happy about. But this is the only one that I thought, well, gosh, this is the only fragrance out of the four that hasn't shown up this fall or Christmas yet. So I'm just really happy to pick up the Cedar and Suede. Suede. All right, you guys. So that is the haul. Um, just a lot of stuff this time around, you guys. Uh, please let me know in the comments down below if you were able to get in on that 550 body care deal. That was a great deal. Or if you're able to get any of these candles. And we'll be doing a review on Cedar and Suede really soon, you guys. Suede. Just kind of seeing how this one performs. And as always, please hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.